All right, thanks, Casey. Well, state fundraising reports released this week highlight what is likely to be a highly contested campaign for Montana governor next year. MTN's Jonathan Imberian has a closer look at the numbers. This week, candidates running for Montana state offices in 2020 filed fundraising reports covering the months of April, May, and June. The most expensive race is the Republican primary for governor. Congressman Greg Gianforte raised by far the most during the most recent period. Since launching his campaign last month, he collected more than $584,000. He loaned his own campaign $50,000. Attorney General Tim Fox raised about $109,000 in the last quarter, bringing his total for the year to about $312,000. State Senator Al Olszewski of Kalispell reported just over $142,000 over the last three months, including a $100,000 loan he made to the campaign. In the Democratic primary, House Minority Leader Casey Schreiner of Great Falls has collected almost $33,000 since launching his campaign in June. Former State Representative Riley Neal of Livingston also entered the race last month and has raised $325. Lieutenant Governor Mike Cooney launched his campaign after the most recent deadline, so he didn't have any fundraising to report. All of these candidates are running to succeed Governor Steve Bullock, who is termed out and cannot run again in 2020. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News. You can find more information about fundraising in the other statewide races on our website.